Well, many of you know I'm a fan of beards. I'm a fan of facial hair. I like the fact that men can celebrate some of the physical differences between men and women. I mean, in other species, the males have more markings than the females, and humans are no different, and I just think it's awesome that over the past several years, beards have become something that's even considered fashionable. You know, I think that's great. Unfortunately, there are always going to be people who are anti-beard, and there is a study from Switzerland that is going to give the anti-beard people more ammunition. There's a study where they were originally just trying to see if it's hygienic to have dogs and humans using the same MRI machines. And what they ended up finding was that a lot of the men that they were, that they were testing had a substantial more amount more bacteria in their beards than the dogs did in their fur. So the studies are, are basically saying that men's beards are less hygienic than dogs. And, uh, I mean, the thing is, if someone wants to avoid that, you just wash your beard more, you know? Actually, you know, wash your beard as often as you wash everywhere else. And then you don't have to worry about that. But another thing is, I mean, we need to build up an immunity to a certain amount of bacteria. I mean, it's the reason why they don't... They, they suggest that you don't over-sterilize baby bottles. You know, the same sort of thing. So... I mean, also, I mean, shopping carts. The handles on shopping carts. It was, it's been shown that the handles on shopping carts have a certain percentage of fecal matter on them. You know? Should we stop using shopping carts? But, uh... The whole reason why I made this video is because I saw on... Uh, uh, Russia Today, there's this commentator known as The Resident, and she decided to make an anti-beard video, where she's saying, oh, that's... this is... they're gross, and look at these studies, the beards are so gross, men should shave. And it's just like, I hope this doesn't, this whole thing doesn't start to demonize beards again. Because to me, you know, there's already been so much of a push for men to be more like women. And if they're going to start pushing the same thing on physicality, it's just going to be quite disappointing for me. Anyway.